Welcome back, welcome back. Uh, it's been, I think, 10 days or such since the last update. Uh, where have I been? I, My fiancé came to uh, Switzerland, where I live. And, you know, there's always the adjustment period of... Oh, blood dripping down the screen there. My sanity. There's always the adjustment period of uh, when you move in together. I had to show around a little bit, set up them some uh, things like um, bank account and travel cards things like this basically that's what I've been doing and you know it is uh, it's a it's a big thing getting someone else into your life and yeah oh my god it's getting bloody here guys anyway I I was trying to do some voice recording at, at the place I'm staying at a uh, friend's place um, anyway long story short the sound was there was super shit so I'm back in my old place to play some gaming and also work on my Arkham reporter videos but for now, uh, we seem to, we have this necklace here, we need to clean it up a little bit, and we found that acid place earlier on. We have no more shotgun shells, we've got uh, 21 rounds here, um, but that should do us fine, I think. But let's go on here, we haven't been down here really, yet. Hmm. Ah! Ah! Christ! I also started, uh, Jesus, he's having a bad day there. I also started a two year course. Um, that thing's gonna jump out at me, isn't it? I just know it. No? No. Uh, I've started, wow, this is new. I started a, a two year course uh, in informatics. I'm gonna get a certificate in informatics and. No, I've been here before, right? So, yeah, this is gonna take up some of my time uh, in the evenings, usually. No, no, this is the wrong way. <laughs> I have to go back to that thing I unlocked. You know, that's the worst thing about it. when you play a game and then you come back to it later on, you completely forget where you were. So yeah, I'll be doing informatics. Um, it's a very promis promising degree here in Europe. Um, very good salary. And you can work from anywhere. And these days, with the world being as it is, uh, <laughs> it's very good to have. And yeah, I'm looking forward to getting it. And oh, what is this here? No, can not look. So we're gonna see how. Oh no, 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 no! Why am I doing that? I will have to have a look at how things go for me uh, once I have that degree. The future is who knows where it's gonna be. Everything seems a bit up in the air right now, as does the fate of my character here. Let's get focused on it. Now I remember there was that acid bath or something with a corrosive liquid. Now if I put the necklace in there, and put it on the statue, that should be the problem solver, no? I believe so. And I think we also unlocked, um, we unlocked uh, the thing that was had a barrier on it. Hmm. Alright, ah, Christ, the poison, the poison. Ah, the poison. The poison. Ah, this thing was, this was what we unlocked though. But my health is dropping it. There appears to be a small a hole in the wall. This is large enough for a small dog to pass through. Well, I don't have a small dog. What do you want me to do? Ah, oh, Christ. Ah, let's move. Let's move, lads. We are not doing too well. Ah. I'm going to have to heal myself. There's the bath for the statue. So, okay, we are getting somewhere. Let me just uh, heal up. Better sanity. And a bit of health. A little bit more health there. Why not? Hmm. There's a small basin or font. Okay, no. Not yet. Don't push it yet. Because we are going to use this one there. Now we are going to push it. Yes. Now the liquid will come down. This is, uh, yeah. Hmm. Bingo! I got it. So now that gold statue, I don't have anything else gold, but that will go on to the figure. There was a figure that was requiring gold now. We did silver already, but we need, no, we did bronze already, but now we need gold. So I'm gonna get back to you once I figure out where to put this and yeah just before I disappear I just want to say 
thank you guys for sticking with this channel i know i see it growing it always ticks up in growth uh every every few days and thanks for always commenting and being there you know i i really appreciate it anyway i'll get back to you guys when i figure out where to put this um statue uh, no the necklace be right back all right we seem to have found it I did read in one of the comments, uh, I did check my comments every now and then, uh, that I forgot... Who? Remember me, Alex. How can I forget you, Grandpa? You've always meant the most to me. Ever since... Ever since my parents died. Yes. Ever since they were killed. You've been my little girl. What? This can't be happening. Hmm. Grandpa got a little creepy back then. Tell me, guys, which story are we thinking of? Hmm. Dun 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 dun. The thing on the doorstep. Of course, we saw Asenath wait. There, she was uh, one of the waits. It was the wait. Wait, right? Yeah. And then. <laughs> Yeah, she was basically inhabited by her. Oops. Let's let's uh, unleash some fury. Yeah. So basically, it looks like my grandfather wants to overtake, uh, overtake me, to live for eternity. You know. Ah. Okay. You're beheaded. Take it. Take it. Take it. Balls deep. That's how. Oh, he's gonna explode. I'm a clever gamer. No, no finishing. <laughs> uh, every time, every time I see it, like, oh, oh, you're a big one, aren't you? Oh my God, that looks like the Shambler from. Um... Oh, you do it me like that? <laughs> okay, okay, this, let's go. It looks like the Shambler from uh, Quake. Yeah, reload, bro. Re reload, reload, reload. Eight rounds. Why do I have to fight you, actually? Go away. <laughs> uh, by the way, guys, uh, I was going to put this in the Lovecraft newsletter. Quake is now fixed. I know previously you had to do a lot of modding, blah, 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 just to get it running on a modern computer. But now it's been fixed, so you can go onto Steam, download Quake. It'll run in 1080p, uh, 16 by 9 perfectly. Yeah. Ow! Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, there, like that. So I just thought you guys, I tell you, uh, my sanity's gone down the toilet here, but uh, let's keep it low, actually, just for the hell of it. Ow! 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 Not my health low, though, bro. Come on. Ah, there we go. Wow, it's dark in here. No, nope, not that one. There we go, that's better. Someone did point out in the comments that uh, in the previous statue when I was playing as the Persian lad, the, the Prince of Persia there, I, I missed a ladder going up. Um, I don't think it's going to affect the storyline. It will affect the ability, according to the commenter. That oh, what? It will affect my ability to get a win. Okay, man, these are the skinny guys. They burn anyway. Let's cook some ghouls. It will affect my ability to get a weapon later on, um, like the ultimate weapon. But you know, screw it. My sanity is like truly in the toilet here. But <laughs> let's just leave it. Uh, <laughs> let's leave it as that. Finish him. Yeah, okay. If I get my sanity back normally, c'est la vie. If I don't, just leave it. Yeah. If it counts as any good. Oh, what is this here? 
examine details. The eroded mural appears to depict the arrival of a strange godlike entity before an ancient human tribe. Lindsay cannot recognize the god in the mural. He is mystified. Sanity check? No, no sanity check, but. Yeah. Looks like an elephant god or something. But yeah. Just imagine you actually did have art discoveries like this, you know? I used to be obsessed with Egyptology. I still am to a degree. I, I really love it. Uh, but the gods, the depictions there. Like, if you look at this now, it looks like a scene from reality. Like something that really happened. Egyptology, like, for example, when a person dies in, e in, in that mythology, they have their heart weighed on a scale, right? And if it's, it's weighed against a feather. And if it's too heavy... It gets devoured by a crocodile and you go to Egyptian hell. Um, that type of thing. That seems like, okay, yeah, it's fantasy and such. But this looks as, if I was an archaeologist and I saw this, I think, this is eerily like reality, you know, almost. So, that's interesting. Hmm. Oh, I know what this means. Use our brush. Magical Codex. It means I can do a new spell soon, it seems like. Hmm. Okay, we'll do the spells later when we need them. Because right now they don't seem like the offensive spells against enemies. I'm I'm quite happy to actually just use my physical abilities, you know. Swinging a sword. Oh, that's dark. Swinging a sword, using guns. I only have... Oh, okay, 16 rounds. Yeah. I was going to say that... Uh, yeah, maybe I'm going to be doing a lot more online stuff lately because in Switzerland, our beautiful government in all their wisdom has decided that I am a dirty animal and cannot enter into buildings anymore. I cannot enter in a bar, a restaurant. Mm. Quite fond of weightlifting, as you know. That's out of the question now because I am dirty. I'm not allowed to go in with a clean vaccinated people. That's now in Switzerland, so... So, yeah, I guess I'll have a lot more time at home uh, if I'm not, I'm not spending the usual hour and a half at gym. So, yeah. Oh, well. So, love you. Ow! Oh, Ow, oh, you son of a bitch! Squash him! Yeah! <laughs> See what I did there? I squashed him. Alright. Now, let's go. What? Oh! What? What are these little bastards? Oh no, 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 no. Heal, 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 heal. Heal, my dude. Those are... Um, I'm leaning into the microphone there. Why are they so small? Okay, guys. We're going to have to go in here. I, you know, I know it's a, uh, um, <laughs> let me just do some commentary while I'm, I'm hacking away here. I have to talk about something, you know, it's my let's play job. <laughs> um, but, you know, I know it's a political issue these days, vax versus unvax, but I, I'm, I'm not taking that shit, man. I had COVID, I had it officially, you know, tested with a PCR and everything. Oh my God, I'm getting ass handed to me. So, I've had worse hangovers by far, you know. <laughs> I know it's possible that, you know, with the new variants, as quote-unquote, you can end up badly and such, but, um, you know what, I'm taking my chances. I'm not letting them inject me with anything. Um, but, this is the, this is the, the heal that I'm willing to die on, to fight on, you know. I'm just not taking it. Simple as that. And yeah, that seems to be how society is now and Ah It's just sad, you know, it's frustrating. I, I don't wanna be like a Yeah, it's just a, such a divisive issue and I'm i I'm strong in my opinions on things. But you know, we're all on this channel just to enjoy a little bit of Lovecraftian entertainment, you know? 
So I'm not trying to like force my opinion on anyone. If you want to get it, I, I have no problem with it. You do you. Um, yeah. I just thought I'd mention it because, you know, I'm a Let's Player. What else am I going to talk about? <laughs> Alright. Mm -hmm. No, I came through here, no? No, I came through there. Others? Okay. Oh my god, there's bugs on the screen. I thought my my apartment was just dirty. Okay. My sanity's a bit low, but... Ah, the poison gas. Ah, Seabell. Now there's nothing here. There's nothing, nothing. No. Nothing. Ah. Come on, move it. Move it, buddy. Ah. Ah, it didn't heal. I am, I am in terrible shape, but it seems that, like we're making progress, guys. We got something to unlock there. Ah, let me heal some more. And you know what? Let me just get uh, acquainted quickly with uh, some spells here. I'll be right back. Hold on. Ah, I tried to <laughs> use some magic, but uh, yeah, I have no magic left from healing. So we're gonna go old school on these guys again. Oh, this guy's gonna give us a rune. We should be able to unlock uh, a lot more, maybe some more spells. I really like the progression in this game. It's it's giving you not too much too soon, because that's always a problem in gaming, right? That you get too much too soon, and then you become overpowered, things like this. This game is really well paced, you know, and it gives credit to its long longevity. Longevity? Yeah, that's the one. So, <laughs> I'm very happy with this game. I really wanted to be playing it the whole time, uh, but I couldn't... You know, you, you have responsibilities in life, and uh, yeah. Let's go on, lads. Uh, oh, God, that's me! How am I doing? Look at this. Yeah, okay, my sanity is low. This is why I wanted to keep my sanity low, guys, because... Do I have a weapon? Oh my god, I do have an attack. <laughs> uh, yeah, I wanted to keep my sanity low for this reason. Just to see all the crazy shit that happens. But this actually is not too out of the realm of what Lovecraft was all about. If you think about it, he was very much about, in his stories, about the degradation of the human being. Now... Hmm. Just sipping some port wine here, guys. Uh, oh, look at oh, I died of boredom. All right. <laughs> Am I so boring? I even my character dies when I talk. Now I was going to say that Lovecraft even mentioned oh many times in in his stories about the, how the human sort of becomes degraded. Now, if you look at the typical human death in a Lovecraft story. Okay, my health is fine. If you look at the typical human death in, in not a Lovecraft story, in, a, in any other story, a person dies, gets eaten maybe by a monster, big deal. But in Lovecraft stories, you are muta mutated, twisted, turned into something perverse and revolting to the, to humanity. That is... That is, uh, if you want a, a perfect example, you need to look at The Thing, the film, 1982. I cannot recommend this film enough. Uh, like if I became a dictator, that would be displayed every night. <laughs> Alright guys, let's go hardcore again. Oh, oh, no, hold on, let's try, try to, dis oh, I don't have any magic, I do have magic. Let's do some destruction spell. Uh, damage field, yes. Oh, that seems to be working, right? Oh, he's gonna explode! Oh, they're all gonna explode. Oh, wonderful. Oh, my god. I'm a bad... Okay, I, I hurt myself, but... 
Good for me. <laughs> sanity is completely in the toilet. I need a little bit of sanity, guys. Others are. I cannot even. I notice the controls go funny as well. All right, we're back to normal. Where was it? Uh, there was a page I could pick up. There we go, guys. A scroll of paper sits upon a ledge, circling the dais at the center of the room. Pick up. Summon Trapper spell. We got some new spells. Chatoga is here. Summon creature. Summon a creature. Well, that never turns out well in a Lovecraft story. But okay, if you want me to. So Chatoga. Uh, minus one, and then Aretak. Okay. So let's make a new spell. So that one, Chatoga. Minus one. Where's it? Where's it? Where's this one, right? All right. So maybe it summons something to fight for me. Hmm. All right. That'd be worth interesting. Uh, worth looking at. Oh, there's something glowing in the background there. Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna try and conclude this episode in this video at least. It looks like we are getting there actually, you know, with all the spells we've discovered. Oh boy! I think we are concluding this episode, lads. We found the bastard. Uh, heal? Alright, and let's have a little bit more port wine for the courage. Mm. Can you guys get port wine there in America? I wonder. Because. One of the reasons why I could never live in America, I think, no offense to you guys, is all the little niceties that we have here in Europe. You know, I could just never do without it. Alright. I feel like um, the end of Pirates of the Caribbean 2, Jack Sparrow, you know, when he faces off against the Kraken. Alright, let's go. Let's see what happens. Is not easily controlled. What makes you think I want to control it? <laughs> Arrogant man. Kill him! Make sure you succeed this time. There must be Mantorok helping me out there or something. The darkness shall. Yeah, yeah, skeletal. Whatever you say. Alright. I think I've realized what my problem here is. With this with this um, game. A little bit. A little criticism. It's going a little bit August Derleti. The good ancient beings versus the bad ancient beings. Now, I remember reading uh, Out of the Eons, right? That was also a co-written Lovecraft story, or ghost-written, however you want to call it. And it had some big bad entity that was basically this thing. Okay? Here, it's like on our side. In the Lovecraft story, it turned you to a living mummy. Just by how horrific it was. And... Yeah, this just... That part is rubbing me up the wrong way. Like, this is my buddy. This is my ally. Hmm, okay. It just doesn't sit well. But I still love the game, and... Yeah, it's Lovecraft here. I, I give it my stars of approval. Okay, let's go. Let's see what's going on here, guys. Do not touch the heart, flesh, and bone, lest you become like me, a dead, rotted husk. I have waited many centuries for you. It was not easy hiding from the Dark Ones as they searched for me. At first they passed by, not thinking that the heart was inside my dead body. But I was forced to find refuge here. You must seal the heart so it never contacts your flesh, and take it to the gathering of light. Take the heart there, 
or the world shall fall under a reign of eternal darkness. The veil of reality can only be pulled back so far, mortal. Take your stand and fight the darkness. Huh. Well, don't touch it, right? She, she said to cover it up. done and I give it to the grandfather right yeah exactly but well, maybe he touches it oh now I can go find it in reality because now I'm like seeing the dream where it is and the demon and the karma it looks like a pop magazine okay okay Chapter complete, guys. Okay, we got through that nicely. Alright, guys. This is where we're going to end it. Uh, what, what's in my hand? Oh, I have a gun? What? Oh, yeah. I did find a gun, didn't I? Yeah. Alright, it just goes to show. Alright guys, I'm going to end this video here. But, um, I feel really guilty for leaving you guys without uh, uploads lately. So I'm going to end it here. I'm going to upload this one for tonight. It's uh, Friday night. I'm going to upload, but as soon as I stop this recording, I'm going to play some more. And I'm going to upload that for Saturday night. And maybe I even get one for Sunday night. I also want to do some voice recording for the Arkham Reporter channel because I need to upload there. I cannot neglect it any longer. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for understanding that sometimes, yeah, I'm the, the shittiest YouTuber in the world. <laughs> I, um, thanks for always sticking by and liking these videos and leaving comments. I, I do read them even if I'm not uploading, you know, so I'm like there, like some phantom in the dark. Anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you guys think and uh, I'll see you in the comment section tonight. Uh, before I go to bed, I'll go check it out. Oh, don't shoot. What are you shooting for? And I'll see you also on Saturday. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Cheers.